You have unlocked a new bonus. As we go and see... Mark Wahlberg. How did he get that mark on his face? Why has he got bulging lips? Who knows? It's a Tuesday. And we're at the station, not the office. Because that is Ricky Gervais. Ooh, it's the wifey. Do you think it's gonna take long? No, he should be finished soon. Ooh, yo, a hottie. Yeah, let's stink the glasses on, see what's hiding. Be a stinky fucker. Hey, on, I on. AOI means something that's totally different for me. Stands for Aberdeen Royal Infirmary. This is a hospital. Ooh. Games? You're gonna play a game? <laughs> Funny. Oh, brilliant! We're playing Breakdown! Oh no, I wanted to play... Yeah, they're gonna get suspicious if we do that any longer. Let's, let's stop. Fun, but no, we're not playing the Great, the great Escape. No. We different positions. <laughs> Can he get any more ball? Let's find out. No, nope, we're back to the feet again. No, I don't want to play with the glasses. Escape. What's fun in playing the ball? Oh yay! About fucking time. I'm off, Charlene. I'll look at Is the that reports an later. I'll cancel an apple all Sony? appointments for this afternoon. Okay. Oh, Captain. Oh, Agent seven. Norman Jaden oh, from the FBI is here. Jaden, of course, we've been expecting you. He's got some handshake I'm in a bit of a hurry. Controller. Do you mind tagging along? We can talk as we walk. Yeah, of course. I wanted to introduce myself before getting started, but uh, perhaps there's a better no, time. No, no, now it's fine. I just have to get to the press conference. We have them every day now. Believe me, it's not always easy finding something to tell them. Fortunately, today we have some news. You killed them. Have you met Lieutenant Blake? Yes. Yeah, we met this morning. He has his own methods, but he's a good cop. I'm you sure, sure you'll get them well together. Do you know how to tie a knot in a necktie? I guess. Oh, you're touching it. Frank with you, I could have done without the FBI on this one, but the press are all over us. This origami killer case crept up on us, and it's fast becoming a national concern. Really, I'm not really paying attention. I'm trying to tie you, tie you. Country, but what do you know? This guy is exotic. He leaves flowers and origami figures. Work that one out. Then the press get onto it, and we suddenly become the center of the universe. I'm here to arrest a serial killer. With all due respect, sir, the rest of it, it's none of my business. Why don't you no. just kill him instead of arrest him? Of course him? not. All I'm asking is that you make progress, and fast. The press want a perpetrator. Oh, right, well, let's pick you up as serve him up on a silver platter. Let's make it Barney. Barney the dinosaur. Hmm. Not Waste bad. of a kid's life, that is. Might as well kill him and arrest him. Preferably oh, kill him. Go see Charlie and she'll show you to your office. Oh, and we check have an in office. on the press conference if you're interested. With Richard Gervais? It'll give you an idea of the political Merchant, climate around here. Thank you, Steve Krell, sir. Yeah. Welcome to the club, Jaden. I should get Perry's assistant to show me my office. I can't wait to get to work. Captain Perry is doing his press conference now. Might be interesting to have a look. 
strange character, Captain Perry. Seems to be more interested in meeting the press than investigating the crime. I saw Blake when I arrived. Maybe I should go talk to him. This morning, on a patch of wasteland in the East End at about 6.30 a.m. Solid. Five days after he was reported missing. What type of things are they using? An autopsy will be conducted tomorrow to determine the sure these people are journalists? But going from first indications, it would seem that he drowned. The state in which the body was found suggests the methodology of the origami killer. The investigation should confirm this in the coming days. The police are continuing to work around the clock to yeah, find the murderer they are standing as on their as asses. How can they stand on their asses? I'll field some questions. Yes. They stand you on their the asses because they can stick their tailbone. The can you be more no. specific? An origami figure was found in the victim's hand, and an orchid Why was no? placed on his chest. His face was covered with mud, but there were no visible traces of violence to the body. Go ahead. Uh, the Zodiac Killer was never identified. Perhaps the origami now the killer Zodiac Killer is either. a real um, serial killer. I don't think there's much chance of that. May have seen the film the Zodiac. Moment, they were actually close to the the catching him, but wandering cops fucked up. But in the end, up. he'll make a mistake and we'll be oh, there well. to arrest him. The Zodiac Killer is probably dead now. He'd be yeah. released in the 70s. Did the killer leave any written evidence? Perhaps a ransom note explaining his actions? Or anything like that? No. Uh, he has not made contact in any way, and we have only the murders to help us understand his motives. Yes. What's the question? Some people are saying that the police were slow to take an interest in these murders because the victims lived in poorer parts of the city. What do you say to that? That's absurd. The police make no distinctions between victims based on their social class. Lies. Lies. It's true that the Otherwise, Harlem would be fine and dandy in the more is. parts of town. The Not. higher crime rate in these areas makes the investigation more difficult. Time for a couple more. Yes. There are rumors that the FBI has sent a profiler to help with the investigation. Run. Is that true? You seem to be well informed. Yes, we asked the FBI to send us a profiler to help us with this investigation. We were planning to announce this in the next few days, but it seems that won't be necessary. According to certain sources, the town hall has been applying pressure to avoid any mention of a serial killer in order not to have an adverse effect well, on the mayor's election so about politics. Do you have anything to say about that? Pure speculation. At no time has the mayor been involved in this investigation, except to support the evidence. Oh, well, and let's look at Blake. While we nick his cup of coffee. Yoink. I wish. Go round and round the circles. Where is Blake? I can't see the fucker. Ah, let's the fucker. I'm ready to start. Maybe we should kick off by talking about the case. I have some work to finish here. Let's talk about that later, if you don't mind. Okay. Uh, no problem. Just let me know when you're available. Because I want to take you out on a date and fuck you. Nice watch. Oh, it's the present we offer to our new lieutenants. We bought the same model each year for the past 20 years for each promotion. It optimizes everybody's time, and it's the kind of thing that always goes down well. You can contribute to our fund if you like. We're still a few dollars short. Congratulate Larry on my behalf. I'll be sure to do that, sir. Captain oh Perry God, said you could show me to my office. Eh? Yes, of course. And one Follow eight. me. Suddenly. Ooh. Oh, wait, wait. Da, 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 da. Catch up, come on. This isn't an office, it's the janitor's fucking closet. Rumi. This? This is my office? That's where I was told to take you. 
If you need anything, you know where to find it's me. It's not an office. I bet you it's an interrogation room. Now it's gonna fill up with gas and we're gonna suffocate to death. Okay, time to work. No time to lose. Gotta get down to work. First, analyze the case files. Yeah, let's pick up a chair that's crappy. We... Oh, why the phone? Oh god, that's a lot of dust. Sit down. Oh, you want you want me the bump version? Okay. Why there? Oh, you like it on the wall. Okay, I prefer it in the middle of the room. But hey, if you're picky. Oh, now you sit down, even though you pushed the chair in five seconds ago. Let's put on the crappy goggles. Night Rider, baby. Hey, all right, on. Step one. Change the office. To what? We... Declaration. Ah. <laughs> yeah, but you can't go out of the woods, so what's the point? Do, 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 do. Oh, he knows exactly what file to pick. And that one. It's quite an odd control system, but always the same ritual: an origami in the hand, an so orchid on the chest. chest. Never said that before. The victims have always been dead for less than six hours when they were found, which means they remained alive for several days before being drowned. Over 3,500 people questioned. Over 100 suspects interrogated. Not a single lead to go on. Because they're idiots. No data. The killer is white, aged oh, between 30 and 45. He is intelligent, calm, and determined. An organized sure type. He has a car. He's probably employed, but his work allows him free time. Really? So that's pretty much everyone in the world. Eight victims in the last oh, three, three years. years. All boys, aged between nine and thirteen. He lacks that. Then mm. is a vicar. No Has signs to be of a violence. Vicar. The victims disappear from public places in broad daylight. In broad daylight. No one notices Ooh. anything. Psychopath is the killer. Bodies are found three to five days later. Drowned. In rainwater. Midget is a wife of man. We got geo analysis in this one. Yes, we do. Oh, they use real life pictures. The killer has a large comfort zone. He gained confidence rapidly and moved away from his base. Hmm, this won't make the geo profiling any easier. Train tracks and it's real photographs. There is always a railroad line to where the bodies are found. Only in 2010. And all the victims disappeared in this the fall. This is Back to the Future. Theater. Bye bye. Let's look at the clues. Ooh, it's a box. Tire trap. Yeah, we want to analyze these tire tracks because, well, tire tracks can be very rare, and maybe not. The killer's car is probably Ooh, a Chevrolet Malibu 83. Let's 
see another one. No. Crap. Orchid, yes. Let's jail on out the systems. The orchid is a common species. It can ah, be found crap. at any flower shop. We'll analyze it anyway. Hmm. A common species. That doesn't help much. I know, but I still want to look at it. Sure. Let's look at the environment. Oh, this changes our thing. My bad. Oh my god, we're an avatar! Or was it up? Could be either. It's a bit unresponsive for that. Um, before we close, we'll look at the clues for the origami. I was kind of hoping there was going to be more, but... It's a horse. It's Viva Pinata. No prints or specific clues. Hmm. Nothing much to go on. Yeah, we can't put a geanalysis on that, can we? Meh. Oh well. Just one origami Just store one. in town. Does it mean it works in there? Phew. Map it. Oh, that's a wide area. Oh well. Oh, he's back into paradise. Suspicion mail alert. Oh, oh, oh. He's gonna die. He's gonna die. He's gonna die. He's turning into Incredible Hulk. Godzilla! Godzilla! Back out, Godzilla! Here we go again. I better go wash my face. But the door's so far away. I need to take some. I'm gonna faint if I resist. It's all right. I know I can make it. I know. I know I can make it. What is this old stuff? Is everything all right, sir? Oh, he leaves here straight away. Is that the man? No one. No one must see. Oh, shivering like a man. Made it. He's made it. So he, is he gonna turn? Don't make him angry. Don't make him angry. Could have been in the women's locker room. That would have been bad. Now we're following a woman. It's her style. And then it's a manny. And another manny. Better. This is Lieutenant Blake, Mr. Marsh. Could you please tell him what happened? It, it was this afternoon. I went to the park with my son, Sean. We played together for a while, and then he wanted to go on the carousel, so I put him on one of the wooden horses, and when I turned back, Sean had disappeared. Exactly what time did you arrive at, at the park? School? Try to remember exactly, Mr. Mars. Every detail can be important. It must have been about...
415. Yeah, that's at 415. Yeah, that's at 415. I remember exactly because I looked at the clock in the yeah, park when we I've arrived. Yeah, I've great memory. What was your son wearing when he disappeared? He was wearing a coat. A brown coat. And a pair of pants. Obviously. Oh. Beige pants. How could Sean have disappeared without you even noticing? Weren't you right by the carousel? No, I stayed at the carousel. I, I did. I, I didn't leave. I watched the carousel. How could Sean possibly have vanished if you were right there watching the carousel? I don't know. I, I don't understand. You say you took your son to the park after school. Yeah. But you didn't report him missing until 8.15. Why did it take you so long to contact the police? I searched the whole neighborhood for him. I, I thought he couldn't have gone far. Did Sean have any particular difficulties, Mr. Oh, he Morris? knows his name. Anything that might have caused him to run away? Uh, no. No, I don't think so. Everything okay at school? Any particular problems between you and your wife? Uh, my wife and I have been separated for the last six months. But Sean would not have gone off without telling his mother or me. All right. That's all the questions I have for now. You're free to okay, go, Mr. I'll Mars. We'll continue Bye -bye. to look for Sean overnight. We'll contact you if we have any more questions. Do... Do you think the origami killer... Listen, your son's probably just run off and he'll turn up in a couple of hours. But what if it is the origami killer? Well, then we have about four days to find him alive. See, I hate color questions because I'm slightly colorblind, so slightly colors are different. I hate you, Mr. Mars! Hello, wifey. Did they find something? No, nothing yet, but they're gonna keep looking through the night. Do they... do they think it's the origami killer? I don't know. It, it, it's still too early to say... But it is a possibility. Oh, but he, they never said that. Because you sick. What happened, Ethan? How could you lose Sean like that? You should never have taken your eyes off him. I mean, for God's sake, how hard is it to keep your eye on a child in the park? I did. Why did you leave him, Ethan? Why? Wasn't it enough losing Jason? Oh, that's a low blow. I'm sorry. That's not what I meant to say. Oh, he's losing it. You hit a sore nerve there, woman. You should deserve a fashion for that. <laughs> Hug your fucking wife. What's he got in his hand? Nope, nothing. He's just pretending to be upset, probably. I'm saying he's the killer. I don't know if he's the 